Should I torture this guy? Put the guy down by tearing his ACLs. Hey everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to another episode of Red Dead Redemption 2, the Let's Play on the Stevie channel. We're calling it Stevie. We go by both names, but you know, kind of have a split personality <laughs> when it comes to this YouTube channel. So I just got off uh, church and I imagined uh, the best way to apply <laughs> what I learned is to, you know, put down some bodies maybe. Put some bodies in some pine boxes, we'll rob some people, <laughs> but virtually on Red Dead Redemption 2. I've been actually doing some free roaming. I've just been hunting legendary animals and just getting more, um, getting more stuff. So as you can tell here, I already marked like and discovered a couple places down south. Yeah, and I just decided I'd go back up and change my clothes again. So that's what I've been doing as far as uh, off camera is concerned. I also did a side mission that I meant to do. The last mission for Arthur, you automatically go there. It automatically uh, triggers the mission. So. so I decided to pull the plug on that. But fortunately, I could still do the missions with uh, old boy Hamish. I'm probably telling you stuff you guys already know since, again, this game's been out for four years. Yeah, that's really all I have to say other than uh, you guys have your homework. I'm not gonna tell you what it is. So I guess I'll see you guys once I get to Blackwater, so. So here's Blackwater. I think we're just, all we're doing here is securing a loan, I believe. And I know Sadie, Sadie's up at bound time. We're gonna end up with that. You there, help, help me out with anything, anything. There you go, man. Don't use this for liquor, all right? Yeah. Gotta take it. You gotta oh what? Oh, good for you, man. Thanks for the. Thanks, partner. I'm Thanks. all alone, Mister. Thanks for the alk, I guess. I'm not gonna drink it on die. camera. Oh, Zombie oh, there's kids watching. <laughs> Possibly. Never know with these parents, man. Excuse me, sir. Can I can I help you? Uh -huh. Yeah. Go I'm ahead. looking for Mr. Atherton. I'm a friend of Mr. Getty's over at Pronghorn Ranch. Oh, <laughs> yeah, Mr. Atherton is in his office. Hey, please head in. Thank All you. Right. Yeah. Thanks, bro. Brother. <laughs> Can I help you? I hope so. Oh, is this Billy Butcher? <clears throat> I want a loan, sir. A line of credit so I can buy some property. What property? An old ranch. Beecher's Hope. <laughs> that old dump? I, I know it ain't much, but I ain't much of a farmer either. But I will get there. That is a very unusual way of asking for a loan. Mr. M Marston. Marston. Only folk around here call me Milton. It's kind of a joke, I guess. <laughs> a joke, huh? And which folk? Mr. Geddes. Uh -huh. I work for him. He said that you could help me out. I mean, if you can. So old David Geddes told you I'm the kind of man to loan a man with two names money so he can buy a rundown farm on account of his lack of farming skills, huh? <laughs> Don't sound too promising when you put it like that. <laughs> well, how would you put Don't it? Don't doubt me, man. I'm just I'm trying to live the American dream. Sorry to waste your time, sir. Oh, sit down. I'm sure we can figure something out. Now, of course, we'll be expecting you to make regular payments, and given a lack of much evidence you got any means of repaying, the terms won't be too great. But if my cousin vouches for you, it'll be okay with the bank. Really? Mr. <laughs> Absolutely. Is your cousin. Thank you. Now, of course, we'll be expecting our money back regular as clockwork until the debt's settled. Otherwise, the farm reverts well, I have my means of getting that. No matter how much you paid. Mister. I understand. Mm -hmm. Well, why don't you go check out the Trying land? Trying to code switch the contracts and talk to, to Mr. Geddes. <laughs> oh, I heard there's squatters up there. We've been having so many problems recently. They'll need clearing on. Sure. Well, come back when you're done and we'll fix up the paperwork. Oh, I can do that easy. I've been... See, like I said, what a what a fine Sunday to put some bodies down, man. Put some bodies in boxes. This is how I like spending my Sundays. Just just cleaning out some vermin. I actually already cleaned up what it is. The, 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 the Lobos or whatever the heck. I cleaned out a mine full of them. They ain't all that, really. I think I heard a cougar. <laughs> I don't got time for those. What you doing here, fellas? Can I help you, friend? This belongs to me now. 
I hope so. Who's in charge here? No one, mister. This is a free country. <laughs> now that I ain't so sure about. Listen, I'm buying this land. I'm afraid... Afraid you guys are gonna have yeah. to go somewhere else. This place else. is under new management. Who's this? I ain't sure. Some fake city boy says he owns this land. Or he's gonna. Owns it? That's what he says. Okay. And how come we live in here? I ain't sure. Ah, uh, nah. Get the hell out of here. This land belongs to me now. Ain't nothing on this earth belongs to no one, partner. Looks like you made your decision then, partner. John. Oh, look. You're a dead man. Should I torture this guy? He was bad. <laughs> Put the guy down by tearing his ACLs. So, looking like there's more of them, or...? So where are we going now? Terrible performance to start with, but... <laughs> I was literally spamming uh, the dead eye part. Ah, it's you! The man with two names and no past. Come on in. How'd you make out? Well, let's it's just say there are no more squatters. Okay. Well, I got your paperwork ready. Now, you sure about buying this place? It's really run down, and the price isn't too great. I think it would mean a lot for my wife. At least mean I was listening to her. Okay. Well, sign here and here. Mm -hmm. My man's buying a house. <laughs> he doesn't have. Man, times were sure last map then. Like, is your is your credit score bad? Yes. Do you have the means to pay? Yeah. No. Okay, the house is yours, man. <laughs> like, come on, man. Now we own you, Mr. Marston, and we own Mr. Milton too, and we own your property. But. You can buy your freedom each week. Eventually, you will be a homeowner. I understand. Congratulations, you are now a real American, indebted and owned by the well, bank. The American dream. <laughs> they own me, they just own your property. Now, you can also use this line of credit for any home improvements you need to make, of course. I can? Cool. Sure. Be good, Mr. Marston. Welcome to home ownership. It's a beautiful thing. Let your wife know what to complain about. <laughs> Just joking. <laughs> well, I'll be doing that off camera. All the upgrades and bells and whistles and all that. So. Well, it is you. Well, I never. I, I thought Uncle? you was dead, boy. Dead. Uncle? The very same. Come here. <laughs> I saw you going into the bank, and by the looks of things, you ain't robbed it. I've gone straight. Oh, bull crap. No, for real. <laughs> well, I'm trying. All these years, you ain't changed a bit. Maybe a little bit. I thought you was dead. <laughs> not yet. Well, I got some things to take care no, of. No, not a problem. I'll come too. No, you don't have to. Oh, no, I'm real sick, John. Lumbago. Lumbago. <laughs> Slow and... Uh, death, my brother. Evidently. I didn't even know that was a real thing. A little pity until I actually researched the game and Come on, man. looked it up on Google. So we take him down. Where are we headed? West. West? Oh, ain't you a man of few words? Hey, I'm coming. Hold on. So back to what I was talking about. West. Oh, ain't you a man of few words? I can see we're headed west. You know, speaking in monosyllables don't make you seem interesting. It makes you seem stupid. I don't care how I see. Well, now where west are we headed, you damn grunting fool? This ranch, I... A ranch I bought just now. Is that what you were 
you're doing in the bank? Spending all your money? Oh, I want a ranch in the armpit of West Elizabeth. Oh, my lord. <laughs> Not that that's any of your concern, but... I was in the bank borrowing the money. Well, that's even worse. Yeah, you can run from a bounty, John. You can't run from a bank. Is Abigail there? No. She's, uh... Her and Jack are waiting until I'm set up before joining me out here. <laughs> you mean she left you? Oh, I never thought she was a smart woman, but... You know, this makes me think maybe I was wrong. Yeah, we need to <laughs> no close that. that. No. I just bought this place. And you're lucky I'm showing it to you and not looking for a place to bury you out here. Right. <laughs> we are here. This is it. Look at her. Vast. Okay. A lot of opportunities here, man. Not gonna lie. What do you think? Why exactly did you buy this dump? For Abigail? Why? Is she an idiot? No. What were you thinking? I don't know. She said she wanted it. She ever seen it? What are we gonna farm here? <laughs> Rocks? We? You don't have a hope here without a wise hand at the tiller. Enough oh, of that. Too. Get out of here. On your way. No. You're stuck with me. Seems I'm stuck with you. Nah, he John, probably knows what he's doing. Farmer. I ain't gonna lie, so, Uncle. You think I'm an idiot? No. I know you're an idiot. Uncle may be like this, but for all we know, he's a he's a genius. I guess the epilogue part two started now, huh? Oh, he actually changed clothes. Cool. Let's do that mission with Sadie, and it's perfect. They changed my outfit. I will see you guys there then. We're here at Valentine now. Back after. I don't even know how long. This her mouth? This is Vermont. Hera. All right. I thought I told you to leave it, Bubba. And I thought to myself, who this little girl thinks she tell anything Adam. to? Uh, enjoy your drink in peace. <laughs> I ain't got no business with you right now. What that mean? For the last time, leave me alone. Or what? Bruh. Oh, I should have known. I should have known. No, she was a psychopath. Get here before she before she do something. You, you, get out of here. John Marston. It is good to see you. Good to see you still doing psychopathic I thought I heard a rumor you was alive. Things. Jim Milton, that you? Guess I didn't do a real good job of hiding my identity. <laughs> we didn't hear nothing about you. You, you killed a feller up by Roanoke? Sure did. I thought that sounded like you and Shouldn't you be saying Abigail that? and Jack. She, Should not be fine. saying that out loud, Sadie. <laughs> she was always so kind to me. I'm looking to buy some property. Beecher's Hope, west of Blackwater. I'm kind of a farmer now. <laughs> and you? Oh, you know how it is. Bounties mostly and some other stuff. Good and bad. Hey, you any interest in bounties? No, uh, I've gone straight. Huh? Sort of. Well, bounties are still kind of straight. It's legal. I mean, it's legal. Uh, usually. Then, maybe. Come on, then. What? Where are we headed? Strawberry. Got on the run from New York. Good price for him. What'd he do? Rob a bank. With a gun? No, with a pan. He's an accountant, I think. Sounds easy. <sighs> I just yeah. rode here. We got a bit of a ride. I yeah. Know. Telegram. You said you had something to discuss. I didn't think we'd be chasing down an outlaw. There's something else. What? Micah. Micah? I think so. Mike. 
I heard of someone sounding like him uh, about a year back. Okay. We always said if we found him. I know what we said we'd do. That ain't changed. I didn't think I'd see any of you again after you left for the Yukon. Yeah, we came back. Didn't strike it rich. Know, all the way see. up there. But you're a rancher now. I got Uncle with me. We'll be okay. Uncle? Well, getting the scout by that gang out there might be preferable than living with him. Sometimes I think the same. We're gonna need him, though. Our game, do you know that Strawberry is pretty far from here? Or? Where it's strawberry. Can I help you? All right, see what you can find. Like I said, feller's name is Nathan Kirk, banker, bald, forty-five. Okay. You head up that way. I'll oh, me. A bit. I mean, we could go to like a bank or something. Say, I mean to meet my friend in town, but I don't know where he's staying. Bald New Yorker, Nathan Kirk. You know where he is? Afraid I don't know. Of course you don't. Uh, could be here in the hotel. Let's not ask her first. Oh, oh I guess I can't hey, go I, in. I've been a real fool and forgot to ask my friend Nathan Kirk where he's staying. You got any idea? He's a bald feller. From New York. I'm sorry, I don't know. He's at the hotel, I believe. I could be wrong. I haven't played the game to this point in a while. I don't remember, which is good. So. You uh, you seen a fella? A fella from New York? Bald guy? Yeah. A few New Yorkers come here in search of the West. He does it. This one's a wanted man. I work for the government. Uh, sort of. His name's Nathan Kirk. Mr. Kirk. But he's so charming. Oh, see? Is he staying here? He's, uh, up in room three. I'm gonna go pay him a visit. It's government business. I'm gonna go up and jump How off the window. Exciting. Thanks, man. Uh, Mr. Kirk, come with me. Mr. Kirk! Oh, Mr. Going. Kirk, you in there? Who is it? It's just... Stop! Hey! That's Nathan Kirk! Oh! Yeah. Shut up! Come on, jump on! We gotta get after him! Remember, we want him alive, though! Oh, yeah. I think this horse is pretty fast. Oh. A few inches later. Yo, it's horse I ain't gonna lie. Oh, sorry, bro. Man, this is tougher than I thought. <laughs> Why are you running? Probably not. What you got there? There we go. Probably could have caught him earlier, but. Thanks for that, Mr. Kirk. Real fun. I'm an innocent man, but it's all a mistake. My then wife, why are you running? My wife is a, is a desperate woman. How are, you, how are you married, sir? None of your business what I am. She made me do it. She broke me. I did bad, but I'm not bad. There is a difference. Innocent and they'll prove it otherwise. Where shall I send the money? I ain't been paid yet. Send it on my behalf to West Elizabeth Cooperative Bank in Blackwater. Pay down my loans. Might make them happy to see I've got a boss. So I've got a couple of other leads I could use your help with if you're interested. I'm usually at the saloon in Blackwater. I need money pretty bad, so I'll come find you. So that's all. All right, anyway, uh, that's going to sell it for this episode of the let's play of red dead redemption 2 on my channel uh, i hope you guys enjoyed it we are really close to the end which is good and i am ready
to let this series go and play it off camera and just be a jerk to everyone there you go <laughs> looking forward to bigger and better things for this channel so i hope you guys enjoyed it again and i will see you guys in the next episode of this series and or another video who knows bye bye bye